how can you get scammed here in Bangkok? I'm always very cautious when I'm with my kids. Number five, not mentioned by anyone, but I think you should know this as well. Hey champs, what's happening? Welcome to another episode of Tag Along with Chai. We are in the capital city of Thailand, in Bangkok. It's the most visited city in the world, so you expect there are a few hazards here. We're only giving Bangkok a quick visit because we settled down in the north of Thailand, in Chiang Mai. But let me take you back to Asok. That's one of the main train stations in the center, in the heart of Bangkok. We call this episode the five hazards of Bangkok. Bangkok is one of the safest cities in the world. World, like I'd agree with you. Yeah. Coming from Chicago, where it's uh, not so safe. Ah, uh, okay. So, but we're, we're, we talk about Bangkok. What are the biggest hazards then in, in uh, Bangkok? Um, for a lot of people, particularly I'd say older folks, is uh, the sidewalks can be really treacherous. You have to watch your footing at all times because you got even, 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 then a dip, then up, maybe some broken tiles. Yeah. Real easy to turn your foot in a bad way and ruin your vacation. It don't help if you had a couple of pints in you before uh, yeah. <laughs> going home yeah. either, you know? So are you, are you going uh, anywhere else in Thailand or? Oh, I already went to Pattaya for a while with okay. some friends. M been here enough times, mainly done with the tourist things and just spend yeah. time with my girlfriend. Uh, is your girlfriend Thai? Yeah. If you compare Pattaya and Bangkok, what would you say what's particularly a hazard here in Bangkok? Um, I'd say the traffic's a little bit more crazy. Oh, yeah? Yeah, That's for true. sure. Especially if you're like on a, trying to cross the cross street and you don't have a, have like a stop or anything like that. Yeah. It's just kind of, kind of nerve wracking. Yeah. And he's, you're looking for one, looking for one, you don't see one, you just see the ties just yeah. kind of mad dashing it and it's, uh, so yeah. so, sometimes you want to cross the road, but it's worth to walk around or work to go through an overpass. When you can, you should, but you, can't, you don't always have that choice, especially if you enjoy just walking around and seeing the yeah. interesting things that you know, you'll see on any given street here. Yeah. All right, well, thanks for stopping, man. Do you have any um, wisdom to pass on or a message to the world? Um, yeah, watch your step, especially watch after. <laughs> Don't be afraid of the, the street food, it's delicious. Ah, okay, okay, thank you. Thanks a lot. <laughs> All right, enjoy your stay. Is this your first time here in Bangkok? Uh, no, I've been living here for 22 years. Perfect, because we are searching for the five hazards of Bangkok. I think Bangkok is one of the safest cities in the world, but there must be a few hazards. We're searching for them. Do you have any hazards? here in Bangkok uh, that you can uh, think of. Traffic, you can see. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we talked about the traffic and the pedestrian way. Yeah. Are there any other things that we have to be careful, let's say tourists that are coming here for the first time? Well, you know, the uh, the scammers, the scammers. Oh. Yeah, they are, there are scammers. Yeah. Yeah. So how, how can you get scammed here in Bangkok? Well, the, the, uh, for example, the tuk-tuk drivers, you know, yeah. They offer you a cheap tour around the city, oh, yeah. and then they drop you in uh, in shops, etc. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Oh, okay, that's a good one. Yeah. So, how to avoid this scam? Well, just uh, use common sense. And and that is like if they say like uh, you want to have a tuk-tuk drive around the city for free or something. Yeah, for a cheap price, yes. Yeah. So just avoid it. Do you have a message to the world or some wisdom to pass on? No, I, I just would like to tell. Yeah. Come, come visit, have a look. It's yeah. uh, a bit chaotic, but um, yeah. very, very interesting. And yeah. uh, you can have fun here. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. thank you so much, sir. Yeah. Appreciate it. Okay. Good luck with the business. Thank you. Okay, bye-bye. Okay. Can we do this in English, Nick? Yeah, of course, no oh, problem. Lovely, lovely. So, is this your first time in Thailand or? Yeah, oh, seventh time in Thailand. Now. Seventh time. Yeah. Are, you, are you now on holiday or? Holiday, yeah, yeah. yeah. Amazing, man. So, Nick, um, we are searching for the five hazards of Bangkok. Uh, we already discussed about the traffic, the scams of the tuk-tuks. Yeah, yeah, the yeah. road, The roads are not all Crazy. even, so watch your step. Yeah, 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 I know. Which, uh, which hazards do you think, like, you, you know Bangkok a little bit now, after visiting so often? Yeah, I think, yeah, you, you mentioned all, actually, I don't yeah. know, yeah. Uh, the, yeah, the traffic is crazy, of course. Oh, okay. There you go. <laughs> all the girls, the massage girls, keep on asking you massage massage that's yeah. also very annoying yeah 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 and that's which area is this this is super fit but super it's all, uh, all over thailand a little bit or also yeah, yeah, yeah. no matter where you go but i like uh, going up north chiang mai or something it's ah, much better yeah that's where the channel is actually based but i uh i visited bangkok to drop off my mom yeah but uh yeah chiang mai is more my cup of tea as well in the north is 
much quiet and peaceful and yeah. beautiful nature and a, a good time to relax. Yeah. I like also the south uh, very much yeah. on some places, but yeah, not go to Patong or Pattaya or so. Yeah. You are I mean, nothing wrong with that, but it's, uh, maybe yeah, it's, it's, a, it's a choice that yeah, you yeah, make. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't go for Thailand to go for partying or... Yeah, yeah. So the ladies, you think, uh, but um, is that so much of a hazard? Because we are searching for a hazard. Yeah. Yeah. Then, then I don't know anymore no. what you all already so mentioned. So it's, it's a basically a really safe city. I, oh, I can tell really safe, yeah. yeah. Bangkok also. Yeah. Uh, when I left my wallet here, yeah. it stays there. Ah, so it's let's mention that as well. It's not, it, there's not many hazards. It's yeah. actually quite safe. Yeah, it's very safe here in Thailand. Yeah, yeah. 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 I, I like Thailand so much. The, the, the friendliness from the people, uh, yeah. the, the honest, and they have no money and they, and, they, and they help you anyway. They give the last penny to you to, yeah, to yeah, share. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, that, yeah that, that's man. Thailand. Yeah, that's Thailand. So how long is your stay this time? Uh, three weeks. Uh, I have to work also, uh, so I can only have three weeks yeah, holiday in a row. I got you, I got you. Uh, uh, do you have a message to the world or some wisdom to pass on? Uh, travel as much as you can to Thailand, it's a beautiful country. <laughs> okay, thank you so much. Now, Bangkok is a safe city. Are there any hazards? Um, motorbikes are the only hazard I can think of. Everything <laughs> else is pretty safe for yeah. walking around, for living your life. Yeah. I'm fairly careless with my possessions and I've never had any problems. Perfect, perfect. So, okay, motorbikes, that's like traffic. Traffic in general is bad, but the motorbikes are what causes the highest rate of uh, fatalities here. Yeah. So, I'm always very cautious when I'm with my kids. Oh, uh, yeah, well, fair enough. Yeah. Are, are you, um, uh, none of my business, I know, but do you have a Thai family or? No, my family is Australian British. Okay, so you, uh, how is it living as a foreigner in Bangkok? It's great, it's a wonderful place to live. Yeah. It's. 24-7 uh, city, so you can do everything all the time yeah. and it's great fun. There are so many positive things, but what's, what, what would be the downside then? Um, I think after five years here, the biggest downside has been COVID, stuck away from my family. But again, being in Thailand has been a lucky place because uh, Bangkok is a big city, so it's difficult, but we can always escape to the beach or escape to the mountains when yeah. we want to up in Chiang Mai. Yeah. We've got a great range of food on offer here. You know, delivery is amazing, so you, you don't even have to go anywhere <laughs> if you want anything. Um, yeah. Another, I can't, off the top of my head, I can't think of any no. more downsides. I'm that's very so, content here. Yeah, that's so, I'm so happy to hear that. Do you have a message to the world or some wisdom to share? Come and try Bangkok, it's a wonderful place. I agree, let's go. Yeah. I think Bangkok is the, the safest city or one of the safest cities in the world. Yeah, it is, it is. Except for the traffic, you know. The traffic is one of the hazards. Yeah. Uh, but violence, unprovoked violence is very rare. Yeah. So I would say the traffic and then of course in this area here, the tourist area, tuk-tuks and you know, a little bit of cheating or Ah, like it's a little bit scamming. Maybe. Yeah, yeah, a little bit like that. Okay. Other than that, I would say it's safe. And yeah, there's a nothing else that you can think of? Not really. I mean, if you... Of course, it's a different uh, culture and environment. And uh, it's not as it is in Europe, obviously. Yeah. But uh, I think that's it. It's, it's, it's safe. It's... Small, small scams, uh, tuk-tuk drivers yeah. take you for a ride, you know, yeah. and then the traffic. Yeah. I would say that's pretty much it. Amazing. Thank you so much for stopping. Do you have a message to the world or some wisdom to pass on? Welcome back to Thailand. We are open to business and to tourists Woo! again. The five hazards of Bangkok. By far, number one is the traffic. The traffic is insane over here. Try to avoid any motorbike taxis or driving a motorbike in general here in the city. It's quite dangerous. Number two. Watch your step, because the roads are not that even here. Here in downtown, they're well maintained, but as soon as you're going into a small little suburb, you're gonna have to watch your step even more because there are some puddles here and there. Number three, the tuk-tuk scams. This is not really a hazard, but you're gonna have to be aware of this. Fix a price before you get in and you'll be all right. Use your common sense. Nick, the Dutch guy, made us aware of the ladies here in the south or in Bangkok, even in the north as well sometimes. Uh, the ladies are trying to drag you in for a massage or for maybe even for more. Not so much of a hazard, I think. Just say politely no and you'll be fine. Number five, not mentioned by anyone, but I think you should know this as well. Bangkok is not cheap. 
So one of the hazards will be that you're gonna run out of money. If this is gonna be your first time here in Thailand, I don't think it hurts to check how much you spend on a daily basis in the first week, so you actually know how much money you spend in your own currency. I wanna do a big shout out to Anta UK. He contributes directly to the channel via Buy Me A Coffee. William Daniel, you did this as well. Again, thanks a lot. Thank you for watching till the very end. We keep on traveling, we keep on doing this interview, so if you're new to the channel, watch another one and please consider to subscribe to the channel. I would like to say from the center of Bangkok and one of the busiest crossroads in town at Asok BTS station. Bye for now and stay champ.